it is Wednesday, April 18. It is already 2 o'clock p.m. and I'm really late to film um, because my battery died because I forgot to charge it and so I'm starting right now. My battery is fully charged. Um, I just wanted to show you guys what I got in the mail. Really not a big deal but I got these new gold coasters that I'm going to place on our nightstands because Jamie hates that I don't like to put things on coasters and I think the coasters that he used to have from back in his bachelor days are really ugly. So we're going to put some coasters, take the ugly ones away. And I have a photo shoot tomorrow so I'm gonna get ready for that. You guys will get to see a little bit how I plan. I don't have that much time to do all this stuff. Um, it takes hours for me sometimes. I remember telling you guys we got a new mirror from Bassett finally. This was supposed to come with all of our bedroom furniture but it came late because um, the original one they were supposed to deliver broke in the mail or something in transit and so don't mind this. That's some of the outfits from Vici Dolls. If you guys don't follow me um, on Instagram you probably should because I post daily outfits um, that you guys won't be able to see if you only follow me on YouTube. Um, and then right here I just have all my hair stuff so I can get ready in front of this mirror. But now Jamie and I aren't really fighting over the mirror because it's so big. It's actually I think too big but whatever we love it. So Oh, I wanted to show you my outfit. I'm just wearing this Zara t-shirt. I posted this on my Instagram stories. Another reason why you should follow me on Instagram is because you get to see my stories. Um, but this one's just from Zara. It has that like banded neckline. It's a very stretchy, like comfortable ribbed shirt. Of course, the necklace is from Miranda Fry. Um, you guys, I don't really talk too much about the quality of Miranda Fry necklaces, but the quality of Miranda Fry necklaces are really good. This is why I love them so much. Um, so this bracelet that I'm wearing, just so you guys know, it's Cartier. It is real gold. If you put it next to this necklace, the gold looks pretty much the same. Well, that's because Miranda Fry necklaces are semi-fine, which means they're close to real gold, but they're not. Um, if they were real gold, they'd be extremely expensive, but for the quality of how much they are, it is such good quality and the color is amazing. So that's my little tip when looking for jewelry that's not real. If you're looking for gold jewelry, you know, just make sure you're looking at the color. If it's very yellow, that tends to look more fake and more costume. Um, you want it somewhere kind of in the middle. Compare that piece of jewelry with a real gold piece and if it looks pretty real as far as color goes and it's probably something you should go for so anyway I'm gonna get to um, planning my outfits for my shoot it is raining outside and we're still in bed we don't want to wake up yet I just packed all my stuff up into my car that's how pretty much I shoot and I believe that's how a lot of bloggers shoot when you go to a location you just have everything in your car you change in your car um, from outfit to outfit and that's what it is not glamorous at all um, and it gets really hot and people walk by people wonder what you're doing I think people think I'm homeless because I have all my clothes in my car but um, that's just kind of what you got to do so it's already four o'clock. I am just gonna take a shower, get my hair ready for tomorrow, I think. I think I might do it tonight instead of tomorrow. I'm not sure. I'm pretty lazy at this time. Um, couldn't really sleep last night. Also woke up really early, went to bed late, and so kind of tired, but I'm wearing this little patch on my face for like pimples and stuff. I think I showed you guys this in one of my other vlogs. Um, the stuff really does work. It's like an acne dot is what they call it. 
um because i have a little thing here and i don't want it to be so noticeable for tomorrow all right i just took a shower and i'm wearing an in and out t-shirt yes i bought an in and out t-shirt they're actually really cute um i wish i could show you the back of it but i can't oh, so it's been a pretty long day yesterday was a really long day so i'm just going to order some food and watch some shows. I have an early morning tomorrow for my shoot. All right guys, so it's now 9.30 and I am just gonna watch a show again and I'm gonna go to bed soon and what else? I'm gonna turn these lights down. Jamie and I have this huge thing where we can control it from our phone and we can dim it to like different colors and levels like that. But anyway, um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. It is Thursday, April 19. I am ready for my shoot and I'm on my way to get coffee right now and get gas. And if I have time, I am going to run to the post office to pick up a package. Um, so we actually had to change or move our shoot time uh, to 11 because when we woke up, it was raining out of nowhere. And so wanted to let the sun come out and let the streets dry. But this is my look. I'm really into the pinks lately on my face and unfortunately I have this really big blemish that I made worse by adding like shimmery baked blush. Hi guys, so I've been such a bad vlogger for getting to vlog everything because as soon as I got home I've been having to do some expedited work. Um, and then I'm starving and so right now I'm going, oh my god I hope these bags don't, just trying to get a purse. Oh my god okay going to dinner with a friend right now because I need to eat I really wanted to go to the gym and that was my plan since I got home from the shoot um, but some last-minute things came up and I just had to like get on it I'm just gonna talk to you guys while I get ready to go um, I still have this damn pink hair in my hair from Coachella that I don't know how to take off how in the world do you guys get extensions out of your hair I have no idea I've never had extensions before and so I'm just wearing my redone jeans and redone t-shirt and all things jacket right here and that's pretty much it simple as can be and I'm just gonna throw on some heels to this as well and my phone's going off because I think my friends here I think I have what I need I'll see you guys soon hi guys so I'm back from dinner Sorry I didn't vlog, um, but basically we ate pasta, which what's new? Um, and I am just gonna make some tea. I'm gonna make some green tea because I'm so, so, so full. We ate a lot of food and I didn't feel full when I was there, but walking now I feel real full. So I wanna take that bloat down. So this is the tea that I drink. It's Yamamoto Yama green tea. Japanese. So anyway, I'm pretty sure most of you guys know that drinking green tea can help bloat, but if you didn't know, then now you know. So I pretty much just use this like kettle thing, which is so, so, so handy. I'm so happy that we bought this because it's the easiest thing in the world. Better than putting a kettle on a stove. If you guys don't have one of these also, just makes your life so much easier it's kind of like a portable stove with a kettle on it i guess so my tea is ready i'm just gonna put it in a cup so anyway i think i'm gonna call it a night with my tea um does anyone watch southern charm there's a new episode tonight but i can't watch it because i have to wait for jamie anyway but let me know if you guys watch southern charm i absolutely love that show it's crazy i really like people from the south's accents anyway so i'm gonna end the vlog here for tonight and i will see you guys Good tomorrow morning guys it is friday april 20. i'm on the way to go get coffee right now i am tired my eyes are kind of dry because I'm tired, but we have a lot of things to do today. Um, I was feeling a little uninspired with the videos, um, but last night I just got a boost of inspiration and I had to go find it. Um, so if you're ever feeling like unmotivated, which is the worst feeling, try to find your motivation back. I just 
started searching things online and so I feel like I have a whole new list of content that I will be making for you guys and so I'm gonna try to do it today. I'm gonna try to film two videos and edit one. I do want to report to all of you guys that suggested to watch The Punisher on Netflix. Jamie and I finished the first season. I think there's only one season, right? Um, but we finished it and we loved it. All right, you guys, so I have been just answering some emails this whole time that I got back home. I am about to film my video, so I'll show you guys a little bit of that. just got back from Sephora and I bought this lip gloss this is the Fenty um, it's the universal I think it's called the gloss bomb but it looks nice um, it is supposed to look good on like every single person in the world that's why she called it universal and so far I like it so anyway other things that I got were just boring like just necessities that I always use okay so it's now 444 and I think I'm going to edit a video don't really want to but I also don't want to do it tomorrow which is Saturday or Sunday so I'm gonna try my best to do as much as I can right now it's for my vlog that's going up on Sunday it's gonna be the one where I go to Coachella what's up you guys it is 7 38 so it's almost 8 o'clock I it's already dark as you can tell but I just finished editing my vlog so I did it I edited my vlog and I filmed three videos so oh my goodness I feel so accomplished and I feel so good about myself it's a lot but I don't feel tired I mean I do feel kind of tired I, just, I don't feel bad I feel really good so anyway Jamie is coming back from the airport he is back from San Francisco and I think he's just gonna drop his stuff off and we're literally just gonna jump back in his car and go eat some dinner. And um, it's pretty much what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna go eat Mexican again and um, we'll bring you guys along. Look who's back from San Francisco. What's up? We just had Mexican food and now we're on our way home. And where did we eat? We ate Javier's. Yes, we love that place. Um, All the time. So I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Good morning. It is Good Saturday. Morning. What is the date? April 21st. <laughs> Yesterday was 420. Oh yeah, April 21st. And um, we're on the way to the gym. We just need to run a few errands beforehand. I'm gonna go to the tailor or the dry cleaners and then to UPS, drop a package off. And Jamie's back. I'm back. We had dinner last night, Mexican food, so we need to work it out. And to be honest with you, I haven't been to the gym in a really long time. Yeah, time that's, to work out. Yeah, that's how like crazy it's been that I haven't had any time. Like, I wanted to go yesterday, but I was working literally all day till like almost 8 o'clock p.m. So today's a good day to go. Um, I We're going to stay for I'm a long time, right? No. We're going to stay for a long time, right? I'm already hungry. My stomach's growling. <laughs> Oh my I know goodness. you want to eat, but we got to work out. Yeah. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, uh, it's just Naomi Boyer on Instagram. You may have seen my Pantene Pro V post about going gentle. And I'm so happy and proud to be a part of that campaign um, because it just talks about, you know, how we live in such a harsh world and people can be really mean and just say things out of negative comments. Yeah. Um, just whatever you're going through in life. It could be your anxiety, so you know, go gentle on yourself. So Pantene asked some of us that were part of this campaign to talk about something that you're struggling with. And I don't really talk about the negative comments because I don't like to give that light or energy. Like, I never talk about it. And even if I did talk about it, like in a vlog, when I edit it, I like, don't put it on there, I erase it because I feel like it's not worth my time. But this is a good um, campaign to bring awareness to some of the things that happen in the world. <clears throat> Maybe some people don't really talk too much about it, like me, but 
I want to talk about it today and I want to be a part of this campaign because we need to spread awareness and one person at a time can make a difference. Um, so mine was just talking about the comments, you know, about over a year ago I put myself out there and I was very proud of you for doing that. Yeah, and I knew this would happen and I knew that the negative comments would come, but I did it anyway. And I still get negative comments. Like for example, um, we published our wedding video the other day and you know, I think that most people just know right from wrong. Like when's a good time to comment and when's not a good time to comment. Like on someone's wedding video, you probably just simply know right from wrong that it's probably one of the most important days in someone's life you probably should save your negative comment for another video if you really need or feel the need to write something negative uh, we had so many good positive comments everyone was positive and everyone person, was happy except for one person, one person wrote a negative comment. yeah and she was just pure negative right. don't worry I will pray for you because here's the thing she even responded back to say that I'm commenting because I can. And that's the truth, you can comment. Anybody can make a comment, anyone can comment, but it's what you comment and how you comment that says a lot about you and the kind of person you are. But thank you for all the people that said the wonderful comments, right? There's yeah. a lot of wonderful comments. Yeah, so thank you. And that's why I never talk about it because the ones, there's more good than bad yeah. and the good deserves all the love in the world. But for the sake of this campaign that I'm doing, um, they asked me to talk about like something that I struggle with and to be honest I barely even have time to read the comments so there's probably a ton a ton of ne negative comments that I don't even see and I don't even know that it's there so you guys probably know more than me about the negative comments that are there because there's some you know there's just so many comments I don't get the chance to read it a lot but of course for my wedding video I wanted to know you know because it's my wedding video and so um but yeah for that one person i mean it was just one but it was just kind of like a no-brainer you know you just are taught um right from wrong from a young age like and i don't know what that person's going through but just remember every time you are going to write a negative comment and every time you feel that way you only show your own weakness and your own insecurities and i think people that comment negatively forget that they portray themselves to be that way. They give off that negative energy, probably because of something negative you're going through in your own life. Um, and that's always the case because it's never the happy people that feel the need to write something nasty. So I just wanna again remind you guys, for the sake of this campaign, and just always to go gentle, right? Go gentle. Go gentle. Because if I can help make a difference, then I guess I'm doing my job. And you do make a difference in a lot of people's lives. I hope so. You know, I didn't really come on here for anything like that. And then people say that they are inspired by me and all of that. And I just never knew I could touch anybody's life. And I'm I- I'm very impressed with it. I'm very impressed too. But I also want to say that you guys inspire me. Every time you tell me that, it inspires me more and more and more. So thank you guys so much. I appreciate every single one of you guys even the ones that write negative comments. Um, so, just wanted to say that. And we're gonna go drop off our box now. <laughs> see you guys soon. I see a light in your eyes. I follow you so damn foolishly. You'd be the sweetest goodbye. Give me a heart trip exclusively. Went to Home Goods and you saw us at Home Goods, but didn't buy anything there. That Home Goods wasn't the best. wasn't the best Home Goods out there. So, but anyway, we just went to the grocery store and um, got a little salad to go. When we were at Ralph's, I met a subscriber. Yeah, she was really nice. Yeah, thanks for coming up to me and saying hi. I really like that. And I felt like we already knew each other. So you're really cute. Hey, we're going home now. Tonight I have a girlfriend's birthday, um, and then we're going out after dinner. So it's gonna be a long one. So I'm gonna go home and just save my energy for a little bit, and I'll catch up with you guys later. Got a special delivery from Halo Top again. So cool how it comes frozen, ships straight to our door. But these are the flavors. We have 
chocolate almond crunch, blueberry crunch, mint chip, what's that one, candy bar, caramel macchiato, pistachio, oatmeal cookie, and chocolate covered banana. So these are all new flavors. I'm excited to try them. And so is Jamie. Jamie, you love Halo Top now, right? I love Halo Top. We now. converted him because he's he's a. Uh, it's healthier, and I can eat almost the whole entire thing. He eats the whole entire thing, and I have to tell him like slow down. Thank you so much, Halo Top, for sending these. We'll let you know how all these new flavors are. Let me know if you guys are Halo Top fans as well. Um, comment down below on what your favorite flavor is so that I know and so that I can try it. So it is, I don't know, five something, almost six, and I'm just getting ready for tonight, putting on my makeup. I'm using this Tartlet palette. I should have told you guys or done this vlog or started doing the vlog when I started doing my makeup and then I forgot. So, we're doing it now. It makes sense if you jump in my bed. I see the truth in your smile. I gotta swim to the I love you. We don't want to spend this night alone. Messed up, I'm gonna walk you home. You'd feel the gravity of my heart. If I could, I would give you the moon. Say Coming in too soon Colliding like celestial bodies Oh, oh For tonight this mink pink faux leather dress and I actually never got to wear this besides on my Instagram and for a video so I get to wear it tonight Jamie's just there making the bed good old husband he is <laughs> and um, I'm just gonna put some gold shoes with it and then I'm ready to go my battery is dying and Jamie is also going to a birthday party his friend's birthday and I'm going to my girlfriend's birthday um so I think we'll just end the vlog here and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys, it's Sunday, April 23, I believe. I'm just wearing this Revolve dress. You may have seen me post it on Instagram. It's actually my first time wearing it and it fits me perfect. Have my denim jacket and then these white tiki, sorry, don't mind the basket, white tiki slippers. And we're going to eat some Shake Shack, I think. Hope my battery doesn't die, but I think it's pretty low. I'm gonna go buy some SD cards also from Best Buy because I just need more. Oh yeah, battery's dying. Um, but anyway, I'll probably just charge my camera while I'm out, try to get some footage on my phone, and I'll see you guys soon. try some pistachio by Halo Top. It was a hot day today, so I am wanting something cold. Try this. this is what it looks like on the inside. I love pistachio ice cream. It's good. 280 calories. Mmm. Refreshing. Very creamy. Can't wait to try all the rest of the flavors too. Come back. Huh? Come back. <laughs> Jamie wants a bite. I want a bite. Uh oh, it's sticking out.
I like that one. Yeah. Steamy taking up trash right now, but it's pretty much what we'll be doing the rest of the night. Just relaxing, eating ice cream, and that's about it. So, see you guys next week.